Hey all, Mike here with Cine Samples, and this is the CineWinds Monster Low Winds walkthrough video. So this is a new library. This is the uh, sort of an expansion library to uh, the CineWinds series of instruments. And what this is, is we, uh, as usual, we went back to our favorite place, the MGM scoring stage, and we sampled a large low woodwind ensemble. And so this ensemble, here's a, here's a couple of pictures. Um, this was comprised of, here's how we ha had them set up. And we had two bassoons, three contra bassoons, two contra bass clarinets, and three bass clarinets, all seated in a semicircle uh, to achieve this, this ridiculously beefy, wide stereo sound. So I'll go through the patches. The first one, as always, is our articulations patch. And uh, well, there's t 10 patches total, but the first one contains everything in the whole library. So you can either load them separately or, uh, or just load the first one. So I'll kind of go through. You can access the different articulations by clicking this drop-down menu, or you can use key switches, uh, whichever way you prefer, or you can just load the instrument separately, which is, that's kind of my preference. But So let's go with... Um, We actually sampled a true legato, which is where we sample all the intervallic leaps, both upward and downward, for the entire ensemble. Uh, and then we have sustains. And staccato, which I kind of already played already. We have Secco, which is an extremely short staccato. Lovely. And now we have uh, several effects patches. Um, we got a whole bunch of effects, and... Uh, we kind of categorize them in three different ways. Rumble, squeaks, clusters, swells, and rips. Here's the rumbles. These guys. You're welcome. And clusters. It's great because if you had like a woodwind ensemble patch or something, you can't get that. Um, it just doesn't have the low end. I mean, we've got three contra bassoons in there, two contra bass clarinets. It's so beautiful. All right, and then we have swells, which are, you know, we we had a click going, so they're all the same length. What I mean is, by same length, I mean that they go to the click. So we have two beats, and when we have four beats, 
Um, so those are regular crescendos. And then as you get up here, you've got like sort of hairpin, you know, crescendo, decrescendos. And then rips. Upwards and downwards. So, uh, yeah, there you go. This is uh, Cine Winds, Monster Low Winds. And if you remember, also, we have in Cinebrass Pro, there's a Monster Low, win uh, Monster Low Brass patch. It's kind of a similar ensemble, just this massive, ridiculous... Uh, low brass, uh, you know, multiple low trombones and, and several tubas and chimbasos and such. So that's the idea. It's a good partner to that one. Um, yeah, that's it. That's a short walkthrough. Um, oh, and by the way, yeah, let's go through the settings here. Simple stuff here. So we have control over the legato speed, the old dynamic range for, you know, you know, if you need to adjust it according to your, your keyboard's uh, velocity sensitivity. And then we have a uh, this tape uh, emulator, uh, tape saturation, which uh, is it's the contact built-in uh, tape emulation. And adds a bit of color and glues everything together. Uh, and there you go. That is Cinewinds Monster Low Winds. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.